At this time, what I'd like to do is take you through a double possible triple to left center with the man on first, man on first and second, or base and load situation. And we're going to draw our line indicating a base hit to left center. And then what I'd like to do is just signify that we have a runner at first, runner at second, and possibly base and load situation. Now, in this, this type of situation, what we're going to find is we're going to have to concentrate on the runner at first base. The runner at second and runner at third will score easily on a base hit that hits that hit in the gap. So defensively, what we have to do is defend the base run, the base runner at first base, and also the hitter. Remember, is, is uh, taking a round and possibly taking extra bases as well. So, you know, what we have to do is focus our attention on that. Um, just go over defensively, left fielder and center fielder uh, would field the ball uh, in this general area here. Um, it gets a left center field wall or somewhere in left center. And when that situation occurs, then what we want is we want our shortstop going to go out into left center to be the first um, man that's provided a cutoff. And then our second baseman is going to foul with the secondary cutoff man about 30 feet in back of him um, so that. Uh, the, if the ball does get away or a bad hop or whatever, we have a second person cutting the ball off. Our, our first baseman, then it becomes a cutoff for home. And they're going to be in front of the pitcher's mound, remember, and they're going to be working um, towards the ball. So if the ball is short, please run up and catch it. Try and catch the ball in the air and not try to have the ball short hop. It's more difficult play. Third baseman will cover third because, remember, this runner, at first base, taking second and third and possibly home. So someone needs to cover third. And then we also have our catchers covering home, obviously, because there could be a play at home. Um, also, our right fielder, because the second baseman is left and being, is cut off behind the shortstop, is going to begin and come, come in and be a, a person who covers second base. The pitcher because we don't know if the ball is going to be played at third base or home, we're going to play in between. So they can make a determination depending on where the cutoff person throws the ball, uh, either home or third, then they would provide support in either direction.